Manchester United are currently on a high under Ole Gunnar Solskjaer with the club back in the top four and back in the hunt for major honours. The Red Devils have won 12 of their first 15 games under the Norwegian since the 46-year-old succeeded Jose Mourinho back in December. And Balagay, who visited the club's Carrington training complex to interview Sanchez and Herrera back in January, has claimed he immediately noticed a change in the atmosphere. Under Mourinho, life at Old Trafford had turned toxic. Manchester United were in free fall under the 56-year-old and were 11 points off the top four when Mourinho's head rolled. And Balagay has now said, it's not so much a tactical masterclass, I was at Carrington talking to Andor Herrera and Alexis, Sanchez, I had the opportunity to talk to Mike Phelan, to Solskjaer, and all it is is the atmosphere has changed, there is a sense of unity. There's a sense of fairness. If you work hard, you will play, there are opportunities that everyone is starting to take advantage of because of the long list of injuries, but generally there is a style that suits both the fans and the players. Man UTD News, Balagay believes Solskjaer has improved the atmosphere at the club, Image, Getty, Man UTD News, Balagay interviewed Herrera and Sanchez recently, Image, Getty, that is the logical step of a manager to actually give that to your team, I did feel that Mourinho thought that he didn't have the ingredients, the players, the quality, perhaps the club structure, who actually challenged the best, so he created an atmosphere that was impossible to continue and had to move on, and that was easily sorted. It's just a consistency in the big games that we haven't seen Manchester United produce and we'll have to see if they have that, they need better players. They've got a very good 11, but they need a stronger bench, Man UTD News, Balagay also spoke to Solskjaer and feel in when visiting, Image, Getty, Solskjaer's tactical shortcomings have been exposed just once at United so far. And that was earlier this month, where they were beaten 2-0 by PSG in the Champions League at home.